Hi, welcome to the Tanshi Hara YouTube channel. Hi. Uh, so this is our second uh, episode of the, the Hidden Secrets of the Great Ocean Road uh, travel vlog series. So today we are going to uh, see another hidden place, uh, which is uh, Hopton Falls. And if we, if we have time, we uh, will go to see California redwoods as well, and, and another, another yeah, and another waterfall it's nearby. Called, uh, Triplet Falls. Triplet Falls. So this is still the start of the summer, so we hope there will be there will be water to see. Uh, and now we Lavers Hill, and this is the Lavers Hill Bakery. So we stopped here to you know have a light uh, lunch. And and if you see this place, there are like bird feeders uh, around this uh, small place. So these birds are wi uh, wild birds. So we can donate some money to this uh, place, and they put a uh, uh, they put a uh, what do you call uh, bird bird seeds. And so all these uh, wild birds, uh, they are coming to uh, this place to have their uh, sort of lunch. <laughs> so actually we love this place, we were here before and well, uh, as well. And food is really good. So if and you guys... can see so many different birds around here. Yep. So, yep, now it's time to go to see Hopton Falls. So once you turn off from the Great Ocean Road, uh, there's an unsealed road. You have to drive through this uh, uh, unsealed road about uh, 20 minutes to reach the waterfall. But uh, if you're driving a car, that doesn't matter. So it's suitable for car as well. So there's no uh, no real off-road uh, um, off-road experience in this road. But you know, it's you have to drive very carefully uh, because it's very narrow, unsealed uh, road, and there's so many loose stones as well. Hey guys, uh, so finally we are here at the Hopton Falls. I think uh, we had to walk around half an hour to go nearly a one, yeah, nearly a one kilometer to go uh, reach to the waterfall uh, from the car park. Uh, yeah, that's messy. So there's another weaving platform about two minutes from the car park but if you would like to get closer look of the waterfall and the river you can do the walk uh, to the bottom of the falls it's about um, 15 to 20 minutes walk So guys, if you come down to this place, don't stop at the uh, weaving deck. Uh, there's a small uh, track. So if you uh, if you follow that track, you can come to uh, you can come just here to this waterfall. And wow, see the view. Ha <laughs> 
Oh baby, I I wanted you to be here inside my arms where the night goes down. Oh baby, I I wanted you to be here. Sun comes up and the day goes by. So guys, now we are heading back to the car park. Uh, it's easy to uh, go this way, but it's not easy to climb the steps because you have like uh, maybe one kilometer to climb. So if you guys come into this place, come in the morning, so you guys can uh, avoid all the tourists. And also um, don't come on the public holidays because Great Ocean Road is the one of the busiest places in Victoria. So if you come this, this place on public holidays, you'll see all the tourists in the world at one place so uh, thoroughly suggest you guys to come on weekdays or early in the morning before everyone else and this is how we are climbing back